Hey, sorry I'm late. How are the kids? They're good, they're good. I, I left them with the nanny. They were having some snacks. What are you drinking? Iced tea. Oh, I could do something a little stronger than that. Uh, what happened now? You mean aside from the fact that David is dead, half of our friends are suspects, and I still haven't told Zach everything. Mm, translation, getting arrested. Footnote, getting arrested for helping Ryan. The longer you wait, the harder it is gonna be. I know, Banks, I know, but I, I, I can't call him. I mean, you know how Zach is. He thinks four words are a conversation. He'll, he'll hang up the phone before I even have a chance to explain to him. And then he'll hop in his car and he'll stew the entire way down the interstate. And then when he shows up, that's it. Kaboom. Unless... I mean, it is only a few hours' drive. I don't even think about it. I, I, I'll be back by morning. Kendall, you are out on bail. You're not allowed to leave the state. If you get caught, it'll make things even worse. I will not get caught. I, I am gonna let the air out of your car tires. Okay. All right, yes, that was dumb. That was a dumb idea, okay? Yeah, thank God. Yeah, I have a conference call. I'll see you back at the house. Yes. It's me. Stay. Okay. Okay. Dr. Frankel, come on in. Thank you. Yeah, thank you for coming on such short notice. I just hope I can help. Yeah, well, me too. I, um, I mean, I've never done this before, right? So I, I don't really know what to expect or what happens next. Okay, so just tell me about yourself and the problem you've been having. Okay. Um, I got, in a, I got into a fight, a physical fight with, with a man, and I um, I don't remember most of it. I, I remember how it started. I have pieces of that, and then next thing I know, I came to, and I got a cut on my face. And this man? It's David Hayward. I'm sure you've read the papers. And I, I realized that he didn't die from this fight, but I, I also don't believe that I poisoned him, so I, I want to know what happened. I, I really need to know everything that happened. Well, have you had any memory problems prior to that night? Uh, yes, I, well, um, I recently suffered an aneurysm, and I lost some sort of short-term memory uh, around that, but a few years ago, I, I, was, uh, I, was, I was shot, I, I, and... I lost a big chunk of time with regard to that, but apparently that had to do with physical trauma. And so I'm wondering maybe if, if the fight, I don't know, triggered something and some sort of residual effect there. Well, or... There's been a lot of research lately on double impact trauma, but the, you know, there's also the possibility of repression as well. Why don't you get comfortable and we'll get started. Okay. Uh... There's not gonna be any hocus pocus. I'm not gonna put you into a trance. I'm just okay. gonna, gonna simply guide you into a state of deep relaxation. And then once you're there, we'll explore your memory and uh, Hopefully we can piece together what happened that night. Okay. Hey, Chief, you're gonna wanna come out here. I I'm kind of in the middle of something here. Yeah, a woman says she's a friend of yours. What the hell happened? Yeah. Pulled over for speeding. The state line. She was jumping bail. I want you to go back to the night of Caleb Cortland's party. You see yourself there. Now, what do you remember? Madison. She was my date. She looked so beautiful. We danced and we kissed. But I had to leave to go to Liza's office to find something. What? Evidence for Greenlight. Liza caught me. I went back to the party. Saw Greenlee. She said that she didn't want my help, that she wanted to stay married. To David, and I didn't believe her. I could tell that she was upset that, that she needed me. What happened next? I went to David's room and 
We argued. What is it, Ryan? What do you remember? Kendall, four simple little words. Do not leave town. I, uh, Jesse, I swear I was not skipping bail. You weren't skipping. What were you skipping? To I, my loo? Uh, would you stop? I, I had to get to Zach to explain to him about the charges. So the whole telephone thing just doesn't really work for you? Come on, Jesse, you know how Zach is. I, if he hears that I've destroyed evidence to help Ryan, he would go ballistic. Go, I, Kendall, I just... I, 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 okay, listen, Jesse, I swear I was going to come right back. She was going to come right... She was coming right back, guys. Uh, come, you really think that's going to matter to a judge? I, I don't... I don't know. Okay, I don't know. What do we do now? What do you mean, what do we do now? Well, I take you down to the holding cell. You wait there until your arraignment. What do we do now? That's what we do now. I am so sorry. <laughs> yeah, at least you missed the keyboard, right? <laughs> uh, Miranda can get a little excited. <laughs> uh, I'm just going to get her in some dry clothes and then I'll bring her back down to finish her lesson, okay? Yeah, that's cool. I'm just going to go set up a game that she's going to love. Okay. Okay, tell me about the emotion going through you. You're in David's room. You're, you're arguing. What do you feel? I... I feel very worried. Worried about what? About Greenlee. Why were you worried about Greenlee? Because... Because I love her.